My name is Dr. Jonathan Beattie. I'm a naturopathic doctor here in Ontario. B vitamins are very important as they're pretty much cofactors for every chemical reaction that occurs in the body. So the processes by which our bodies repair tissue, produce energy, and just function on a day-to-day -day basis requires B vitamins so that they'll work. So many people are B vitamin deficient these days uh, due to a couple of factors. One is typically poor intake, uh, poor dietary intake of B vitamins, low quality of their diets, uh, as well as the increased need of the B vitamins in detoxification processes. So as we are exposed to more and more chemical toxicants and, and pathogens in our environment, our body is required to use more B vitamins to deal with that increasing toxic load. When people don't get enough B vitamins, uh, they can feel anywhere from a little sluggish to completely horrible, uh, and in some cases, demented and dead, uh, which is, you know, certain B vitamins, if you're deficient, actually can be fatal. So it just sort of outlines the importance that they have in human health, but generally just like a low grade deficiency you won't necessarily have a specific symptom so much as just you know general sluggishness. There's a variety of things that can deplete B vitamins. Uh, as I alluded to earlier, there's uh, environmental toxins can use them up. Uh, medications, actually a large number of medications interfere with B vitamin pathways as well as with their absorption or are used up in the breakdown and elimination of the medications uh, as well as just again general, uh, general poor diet Sometimes it can take extra B vitamins just to process the foods. Some B vitamins are difficult to absorb due to uh, genetic causes. So people have difficulty with the absorption of uh, B12 in many cases, as well as some cases poor stomach acid levels, uh, poor digestive function, intestinal damage. There's a number of uh, reasons in which uh, B vitamins, basically the pathways for absorption get interfered with. Coenzyme forms of B vitamins tend to be better because uh, that's how they're used by the body. So when we're using a synthetic vitamin, um, the closer it is to the natural state in which it appears in the body, the easier it is for the body to use. So the coenzyme form is usually refers to the form that is most commonly used by the body. One of the best formats for a B complex is to take it in a liquid form. And the reason for that is the increased absorption of certain B vitamins that occurs actually in the mouth before the liquid is even swallowed. Uh, something that you won't see happening in a capsule form. When people take a liquid coenzyme B complex, uh, typically they'll feel a you know, general rush of energy. Uh, oftentimes as their body you know, suddenly is able to fill in the deficiencies and their metabolism is able to work at full capacity, they'll find they you know, have better clarity of thought, uh, more energy, even right down to uh, sleeping better uh, because of the increased absorption rate of those style of B vitamins, as well as the increased usability of the B vitamins by the body. B complex per day, I mean, each vitamin has its uh, specific levels. So if you look at RDA, which is the minimum amount to, required to sort of prevent a deficiency, you know, such as the deficiencies that can cause death, the levels are quite low. Uh, typically though, uh, because of their safe uh, usage, uh, you're looking at about 50 milligrams of each B vitamin per day has been shown to definitely increase uh, the functionality of the B vitamins and really, you know, still being at a safe level, really help to boost metabolism. Uh, the one exception is B12 and folate, well, I guess two exceptions, B12 and folate, which are typically needed at about a milligram per day, not the, the higher 50 milligrams per day. B complex results, I've seen a variety of things. Again, it depends on the initial uh, presentation. Um, but you know, most people describe you know, improvements in energy. It aids in, with certain people in their ability to detoxify uh, harmful components in their environment. Uh, so I've seen a variety of changes in patients and usually, again, because their bodies just start working better.